for the last part in our master fishing class, we're going to talk about a subject that's in the press everywhere at the moment when it comes to fishing, soft baiting. And everyone talks about colours of lures, styles of lures, uh, rigging lures, and they're all very important, but there's one element that to me is more important than anything else, and that's the weight of your head. That makes a huge difference when you're soft baiting. And if you see here, I've got a variety of soft bait heads, and they all have three burrow hooks, but they range in weight from about an ounce down to next to nothing. Now, I'm interspersing this with a clip of my wife Nikki catching a really nice snapper when she just decided to go up in weight because the boat was in deep water, about 45 metres, and the wind had just picked up and we started to drift fast and the bite had stopped and she went to a heavier weight and was rewarded instantly. Might have to get the net for this one. Oh, I'll get the net. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. So when you're out on the water, be prepared to change the weight of your head a lot. Um, and it will change during the tide and it will change during the day if you go into deeper water. And it really, really makes a big difference when you're soft baiting. And also the soft baiting technique, sometimes you're casting forward of the boat and letting the lure sink towards you. And other times you're drag fishing, letting the lure drag behind the boat. And when you're dragging behind the boat, you need a lot heavier head to hold the bottom. So you've got to think about all these factors. So have a variety of weights and you'll be rewarded like Nikki and see the fish that you finished off the show with, it's a beauty. Catch us next time on Fishing NZ and we'll share more of our master fishing tips and have some great fun on the water. Um, I'll, I'll come, sit, keep on going, oh, it's a nice one. Sit. Woohoo! Nice one. That is a beautiful